Conditions necessary for combustion part 3 The third necessary condition for combustion is attainment of ignition temperature. Now let us understand what is ignition temperature. The lowest temperature at which a substance catches fire is called its ignition temperature. Now let us understand the necessity of attainment of ignition temperature in combustion by doing an activity. Let us take two papers, fold them and prepare paper cups as shown. Now take two candles and lit them. Place them on a flat surface. Take some amount of water in one paper cup and expose it to the flame of first candle. Simultaneously, expose the empty paper cup to the flame of the other candle. Take the help of your parents or elders and handle the cups carefully. We can observe that the empty paper cup catches fire quickly and gets burnt, whereas the paper cup with water will not burn and the water in the cup starts heating and then it boils. Once all the water in the cup gets evaporated, the cup catches fire and gets burnt. Now let us analyze our observations and find out the reason behind this. The empty paper catches fire on attaining its ignition temperature, whereas the paper cup with water transfers its heat to the water present in it through conduction. And once water evaporates, the paper cup catches fire as it attains the ignition temperature. Now let us try to answer some questions related to ignition temperature. Does a matchstick burn by itself? And the answer is, a matchstick does not burn by itself at the room temperature. However, if we strike the tip of matchstick to the sides of the matchbox, it attains its ignition temperature and starts burning. Why do you have to use kerosene oil to start fire in wood? The ignition temperature of wood is very high and cannot be attained easily by exposing it to flame. However, the ignition temperature of the kerosene is less. So, if we pour some kerosene on the wood and heat it, the kerosene will first catch fire and the burning of kerosene helps the wood to attain its ignition temperature. The substance which has very low ignition temperature and can easily catch fire with the flame are called inflammable substances. Petrol, liquefied petroleum gas, that is LPG, are some of the examples of inflammable substances. Phosphorus is a non-metal which catches fire at room temperature. Therefore, it is stored in water to avoid combustion. The three necessary conditions for combustion are presence of combustible substances, presence of air or oxygen and attainment of ignition temperature.